Welcome to Touch Base Tuesdays, where we touch base on Tuesdays. Let me be the umpteenth person in your timeline to comment on the commentary around Jonathan Glazer's acceptance speech at the Academy Awards two nights ago. He won Best International Film for Zone of Interest, which, while I haven't seen it myself yet, I have read reviews and heard people who have seen it tell me it reflects on the people who remain complacent and complicit and integrally engaged in mass violence and whatever you want to call it, because the issue at hand is around language. So I have to be very careful of what language I use or it too will get What is most upsetting to me isn't how many people have misquoted him and turned it around to make his his quote in his speech, which for those that haven't seen or witnessed what's going on, basically Jonathan Glazer, who is himself Jewish, said that he will not stand for his Jewish identity, his Jewishness, or the Holocaust. Um, be hijacked as a means to allow for what is happening in Gaza and Israel. And that quote has been widely misquoted both by the media and by individuals on the internet, fracturing that quote and um, turning it to make it seem like he said that he um, doesn't stand by his Jewishness. And what is most devastating to me is not the fracturing of his language. It is that we have spent two days obsessed, which I'm doing myself now, with the fracturing of his language instead of focused on what his language meant to say in the first place, which is how devastating it is that we are fracturing people. And this includes mass violence. This includes death. This has happened worldwide to so many people and is happening worldwide to so many people. And this is what we do. We become obsessed, fixated with the effing language and fracture the language to distract ourselves from how we are literally fracturing entire peoples. At some point, we have to put the whole thing back together. In Judaism, we have this phrase, tikkun olam, repair the world, putting the world back together. I picture it when I see it in my head. It's just like taking the pieces of our collective fracturing and putting ourselves and each other back together. Enough.